Alright, welcome back. So, this particular update is not going to be too Social Link heavy. In fact, it's going to have a little bit of plot to work with. But, we are going to become more intimate with Yukiko by the end of the episode. I'm going to show off the Lover's Path and the Friendship Path. Because we're going to be rank 9 with the Priestess Arcana. So that's pretty cool. Also, this is long overdue, but I actually made a mistake in the first episode of this <laughs> Let's Play. Yeah, I mentioned that Marie was voiced by Eden Regal. And I made the incorrect hey. assertion that she was married to Sam Regal. No, that's not the case. In fact, they're brother and sister, so that's awkward. I don't know. I just saw the last name. I assumed... I don't know. It never occurred to me that they were just brother and sister, so... I goofed. But that's actually kind of cool that a brother and sister can get in on the same video game. Good on them. Good on them. <laughs> I don't think Sam or Eden are watching this, but if they are, I am so sorry. Did not mean to make that uh, mistake. Teddy has fans at Juness, but as we already said, nah, -uh, he cannot top us. Try as he may. We're actually gonna be doing a lot of uh, these late night meetups with our friends because. There's not that many people to hang out with now in the evening, uh, evening time. Because we did... Good night. We did the Devil Arcana, we did the Tower Arcana, and we did the Hermit Social Link. So... Eh, there's not really much point in coming here in the evening. Hmm. Although, we are actually going to be able to do some Social Links in the rain pretty soon. So that'll be pretty cool. It doesn't matter about Tess. Narukami's a genius. He can just pass them all. Because we're just going to get all, like, 100s on all the uh, tests in this game. Because that gives us really good equipment and extra spending money from Dojima. Not like we need it, but still, always a nice little uh, benefit. Exams are coming up, so that's not, but that's not really much of a big deal, because we can just ace them as always. Don't be like a fake ostrich. What? So clearly, it's chicken. Why is a chicken like another word for cowardly? That is a good point. Why don't they just call it Chicken Bumps? That'd make R.L. Stein's book series a little... a little go uh, harder to take seriously. Like, instead of Goosebumps, it's Chicken Bumps. Whoa! It's freezing! Bring your jacket! How are we getting together on the roof on a day like this? Yeah, what's this urgent business about, Yosuke-senpai? It's time for hijinks! Seriously! I was busy handing out flyers at Juness! Hey, I saw you hitting on girls just outside the school gate! That's what Teddy does. Was there some kind of progress in the case? Oh, God. I need you guys. You have to help me. You're the only ones I can rely on. Can you please keep this weekend open? This weekend? Does this have anything to do with that event at the Inaba police station that's been canceled? What are you talking about? The idol Kanami Mashita was scheduled to be the honorary chief this Sunday. But who cares about her? Oh we have Rise. My gosh! The famous Kahneman is coming all the way out to the boonies! Who cares? So she's taking on jobs like that already. I have been seeing a lot of her on TV lately. 
I didn't know she belonged to the same agency as you, Risei-chan. She's just not nearly as good as Risei. I mean, if she's coming to Inaba now, the agency's obviously trying to use all the fuss about me to their favor. What dicks? So what's the big deal about that being canceled, Yosuke-senpai? There was going to be a big sale at Juness to take advantage of the event, but now it's down the tubes! Teddy, why are you Is so happy about this? That You work Please there! forever to decide on canceling the event. My dad's really in a fix now. He worked so hard to put this whole thing together, and I can't stand to see him like this. I can't just let it go. Well, that is actually pretty nice of Yosuke. I heard that the police couldn't prepare for the event because I had gone missing. Oh, boy. I'm sorry. This is my fault. No, it's not your fault. Don't blame yourself. But yeah, it does seem like that's what happened. Yeah, it is your fault, N Naoto. Okay, so you called us up here. What do you want us to do about it? I mean, From the, way it sounds, the only person who might be able to help you is Rise. What exactly are the rest of us going to do? I want everyone to help me with a bunch of different tasks. Um, Rise-san, well, if you could, you know, do an event at Juness. You want me to substitute for Konami? That's kind of a low so blow. Away? <sighs> is it really that bad? I don't know. I may be his son, but I'm still only a part-timer. But my dad's being awfully nice for some reason. I think it's possible that he might get fired if this thing falls through. Ooh, that's not good. If that happens, I might have to transfer schools again. <laughs> Seriously, what am I going to do if that happens? That's not great. We need Yosuke on our team. Singing and handshakes only. Yay! Risa is cool with it. And nothing that I can't do as a high school student. Otherwise, I'll get in trouble. And I'll only do it if you all get on stage with me. But you left the agency, what? didn't you? Wait, you wait, stopped being an idol. So what's the point of not giving autographs? Came to try to recruit me to be an idol. Oh God. Me too. I already have an exclusive contract with Juness. Everybody's got really big egos right now. Worrying about the right things here. Thank you, Kanji. But Clearly, I'm saying, the only one who's going to be an to idol see. here. I need a band, of course. I'll make this very clear. I can't use pre-recorded tracks. Whoa, whoa, there's no way we can pull off something like that. Persona 4 Dancing All Night says otherwise. I have some experience playing the keyboard. My grandfather suggested that I take piano lessons when I was younger. So if the Scooby-Doo comparisons weren't well. obvious enough, here's a fucking another Run one. This? this incident is a result of my actions, after all. I will do whatever I can to help. Naoto, thanks. That's gonna make you very easy to manipulate, Naoto. That's not good. Played it though. Oh wait, I accidentally bought a bass once. I think it's in storage. How do you accidentally buy one of those? Accidentally buy something like that. I bet you just thought it was another guitar. You dumbass. Did it not just say like bass guitar on the fucking price tag? You fucking goof. Some kind of instrument. Oh boy. I need more cowbell. That's not old, is it? I'll look for a song I can sing that can use a band arrangement. You guys get instruments and find a place to practice. Got it. Try to pick an easy one, okay? All right. Now that this is happening, I'm getting fired up about it. Let's go ask if we can borrow the music room at school. Yay, we're getting a band together. Ooh, are we gonna be able to use music, like, so in combat? And I just realized, this is it fucking Tokyo Mirage Sessions, the prequel. By the symphonic band. <laughs> what is that? Huh. It's a gong. That is pretty sick. Well, duh. I'm pretty sure he meant to ask, what is that doing here? Because it oh, looks gee, cool? Play that. You know, it sounds kind of Chinese-ish. Ah. Uh, <sighs> um, I don't think that's gonna really It doesn't matter. exactly work with everything else's rhythm, right? I mean, I'm, I'm probably a little ignorant of music, but still, all it does is gong. Huh? Maracas. I see. Yeah, you do look like that when you're fighting. Try summoning your persona while you're holding those. All right. Persona. And then Jiraiya pops out. Wait, I can't summon it here. This isn't like JoJo, or is it? I'll choose this then. Look, look! Isn't this like my fan? 
I think she's convinced we're playing for a dinner party at the inn. You gotta have the Scooby-Doo comparison. Need stuff like guitars instead of little backup instruments like these. We got two of them. Hey, I'll play the guitar. Why don't you take the bass? I can at least teach you a little bit. You mean nothing? But, master. Whoa. I never thought I'd hear you call me that. You gotta give him an ego boost occasionally. Moves. I've got mad air guitar skills. We are so fucked. Well then, since you two and Natsukun have decided what to play, let's put Kanji on drums. Hey, why don't I get to pick? <laughs> if you're up front, it'll look like a metal band. Aww. I think you'd be good at the drums. You're always hitting and stomping on things after that all. That doesn't translate well to drums. Does that make any sense? Exactly. <laughs> beating the shit out of drums doesn't... Beating the shit out of shadows does not, like, translate to beating drums. Hey, baby. I lay down the passionate beats that flow from my soul. Uh... Teddy's hands make me uncomfortable. Uh, so that leaves Yukiko and me? You two. Um... How about the chorus? There is a part for that. But Yukiko's using a tambourine. No, 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 can do. We'll hold something. Let's see what looks easy. So we're making a ska oh, band. This cool. Look like a band? Yeah, With the exception of Naoto all. and Teddy and Rise. These are the instruments that all the characters use in Persona, Persona 4 Dancing All Night. Is this thing broken? I'm glowing, but Because in Dancing All Night, good. Teddy has like a friggin' turntable. That's how it is for everyone. Naoto has a violin anyway, and Rise has a harp. Let's start practicing. What's with all the tadpoles on this paper? Nobody can read music. We're so yeah, dead. I don't know how to read music. <laughs> We're fucked. Guess I'm gonna have to transfer schools after all. Oh, that ain't great. What if we can get our personas to play instruments? Nah, no, that'd be stupid. Who'd believe a concept like that? Welcome home, big bro. So, hey look, it's Naoki. Let's oh, hang out with him for a little bit. If it's starting to get cold, why don't we just start wearing all of our uh, winter gear? It's only, it's October already. Summer's passed. Why are yes. we still in our summer gear? I don't know, maybe seasons work differently in Japan. Hmm. That's a little ironic given uh, your future occupation, but I'll train you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Especially since you live with a cop. Ah, he ain't... Really? Dojima fucking gets, like, pissed drunk a few times in this game. I don't think we're in much trouble. Also, if the anime's anything to go off of, Narukami can't hold his liquor either. He holds it about as well as fucking Yukiko and Rise. He just makes it look a lot cooler than they do. Thank you. Yes. Seaweed cracker? I've never had seaweed, I just always thought it seemed kind of gross. Good night. Maybe I'm off base there, but, eh, I don't know. Also, you get the mental image of Kanji and the seaweed after obtaining the cracker. Once more from the top. One, two, three, four. Yay, we're awesome. Um. It wasn't me. How do you make that sound with a trumpet? I mean, I can't get any sound at all out of this. 
a hip and young audience yearns for the element of surprise in music as well. Teddy, stop the acting proud of that. Suddenly rings out. An overturning of the expected cliches found in today's sound. You get it? Um. Oh, I get it. That means Teddy did it, doesn't it? <laughs> Kanji proceeds to beat the shit out of Teddy. Overturned my expectations. You decided to take a break from band practice. Why don't we take a break? We've been at this since morning. Good idea. My fingers are all stiff. I can do this all day. Follow up now, Chan. I think I'm falling for you. Bad Teddy. Down. <laughs> Let's just ignore this bear. Agreed. He's only there for mascot power, and that's not doing much anyway. Are we really going to manage this? I'm starting to get the feeling that it's impossible no matter what we do. Really? We fight shadows every other day. This is just band practice. I think we can handle it. Also, this is anime. So, show some spirit, motherfuckers. You really get into that do or die spirit sometimes. I'm your leader. You will do as I say. For him. That's right. Everything would have been for nothing if we give up now. Yeah, Kanji's our hype man. Doesn't begin until you got your back to a wall. Back to back. Start a Death band. comes a rabbin on a midnight train. I'll do it too. It's not just about Yosuke now. I'll simply feel angry at myself if I give up. We're a Guilty Gear worry, cover Yosuke band. Senpai. I agreed to do this, so I'll do it. I didn't say anything pathetic like, I'll do what I can. I'm going to get a huge crowd, no matter what. Because I'm and that I'm awesome. I'm satisfied. Please, I just need your help to do it. Wow. Now that's how a pro delivers a team-boosting speech. Hey! Kanji and I well, worked really hard in our speech, too. Practice? We also sound awesome. All right, let's do this. I did it! I did it! So this isn't broken after all. Okay, let's try putting your music together and I'll sing along. Whoa, wait a sec. Can't we get a little more practice before we try doing that stuff? Playing for the real reset. I mean, I'm all for that. Don't think of it like that. I'm seeing how hard you're trying, and I don't want to just sit and watch you practice without me anymore. Aww. Here goes. One, two, three, four. Laura Bailey's going to sing now. So this is obviously a Persona 4 Golden exclusive thing. Good? Also, we mastered all of our instruments it in two days. <laughs> yeah, it felt good. Two days practice. Like after all. This is anime. Time goes. It's like the hyperbolic time chamber in here. And overcome many obstacles that dared face them. But now is their time to truly shine. Behind the music, Persona 4's band. Teddy back. fell into a heavy drug dependency state. Kanji threw his TV outside of a hotel room window. We've and Yosuke faded into obscurity. On a, show. a midnight one. I was discarding my clothes more than I was discarding my fear. Oh. For me, it was like discarding my public image anyway. Come on, everyone. Let's cheer up, okay? Fortunately, I didn't have a shadow, so you, I'm awesome. You have a bunch of stuff lined up, but you're still only playing the tambourine. <laughs> Haven't you heard the phrase, a clever bear conceals his claws? Why would a bear need to conceal their claws? They're big, massive murder machines. And charm all the girls. That sings about a hawk, not a bear. And don't even think about it. We don't have the skills to ad lib. That's for Tokyo Mirage sessions. We're doing this exactly like we practiced. Got it? What? Yosuke smashes the guitar on Teddy's head sure during the band the during the uh, show. Breaks at work. Just like we practiced. Got it? Well, let's take it from the top one more time. Keep up that energy that we had before.
Welcome back. Maybe Dojima knows some sweet guitar skills. You don't know. Dojima seems like he'd be the cool kind of uncle who would, like, know how to play guitar and know all, like, cool bands and stuff like that. He might have been a roadie back during his day, earlier days. You don't know. If I ever do a Persona 3 playthrough, I guess we'll find out how Tanaka got to be where he is now. And I'm curious if Tanaka's gonna pop up in Persona 5. Who knows? I'm not sure the time frame like between Persona 4 and 5. Although, obviously the time frame between Persona 3 and 4 wasn't really that big. I forget, I think it was like a few months, maybe a year? I know they mentioned this on the, uh, when we went to Tatsumi Port Island when we first hung out with Naoto at the club. I know they mentioned, like, some amount of time passed, but I kind of forget at this point. So who knows, maybe it'll be a, lo a very long portion of time or just very brief, like a month or two. I don't know. I'm sure there's going to be some kind of reference to Persona 4 and Persona 5. I mean, they already have DLC costumes for this and Persona 3, so who knows. So let's go to the shrine, because in the next update, we're going to hang out with Ai and finish up the Moon Arcana. And of course, you know what that means, we might also get more intimate with Miss Ebihara. We're just going through the list. But let's go ahead and uh, pull one for Aerie. We're not going to see her in this particular update or the next one, but we will eventually. Crap! The crowd's a lot bigger than I expected! They heard Risei's here! Like that. You're making me even more nervous! Uh, our costumes okay? I mean, they're just our normal school uniforms. Even worse than the winter ones. What else could we have done? It's not like we have any costumes. I have tons we'll of extra outfits, you guys. Costumes, and since we'll be changing wardrobes tomorrow, it works out. We could have worn our swimsuits, oh, or Just butler uniforms, or secret agent uniforms, You'll be or our featherman uniforms. More than a bear knuckle boxer. You, you shut your stupid bear trap. I don't need to hear this. Enough with the bear puns. You've been on TV. And stop doing the hands. Those are creepy. Aren't you used to this? I don't like you Teddy's face. It's creepy. Now. The last time I played for a crowd was a piano recital when I was young. Doing an interview on TV is much easier. Even if I make a mistake, I'm the only one who gets embarrassed by it. You're saying doing interviews is easy? That's crazy too. She's a detective. She's used to it. Oh, I can't take this much longer. Don't you get nervous too? No, I'm perfect. I'm fine. You really are something. <laughs> now that's our sensei. He's got big brass balls. Um. When I say balls, I mean. <laughs> uh. We get it. We what get was it, it with the he he he? Don't care. Shut up. Stop talking about my balls. And who is that guy? Huh? Did someone just? I'm Did sure that won't come up later. For a second. Y yeah. Got it. Your hearts are all racing, right? So is mine. But that's the power behind a live performance. Don't think about doing everything exactly right. The crowd's here to have fun, so we need to have fun first. My god, this is just Reset Tokyo Mirage you. sessions all over. When I say who's Seriously, ready, you just say this one Mia, thing from Persona okay? 4 Golden is more or less like most of the plot friends, of Perso of Tokyo Mirage sessions. This is a full-blown one-time A lot of the words, a lot of the now phrases they're ready? using is just that. I mean, there's no band in Tokyo Mirage Session, but there's a lot of idol stuff. I don't know. Fired up and ready to go. Now listen up. We're sticking to how we practiced, okay? Teddy, I swear. All right, let's do this. Are you guys ready for an animated cutscene? Because here we go.
Laura Bailey has a nice singing voice. Good for her. I enjoyed that song. Yeah, we're a badass ska band. The people love us. We're asking for an encore. But we only have the one song. I didn't think about that. Really? Play that same song! The same song? Okay, let's go. Ignore them and leave, or play the same song over again. Well, the first one seems kind of like a dick move. Maybe we can have Risa explain our situation and they'll go easy on us and let us replay that song. Who's that guy in the green? That guy's suspicious. I saw that guy before. I'm getting fired up! Does nobody see the aura on the teddy bear? Oh. Uh, Ted? Oh, there he goes. Mosh Pit! And they just tear Teddy apart. Huh. Well, alright then. Stupid Teddy. We can't play without him. Just say they took our fucking, uh, tambourinist. Why don't we all dive into the crowd? They might just carry us out of here and we can escape this awkward situation. Uh, that's a good idea. Yukiko's way too excited about that. Actually, if all seven of us jump in, there'd be trouble. Why? Oh, I understand why. Never mind. Then what are we gonna do? Do we have any other way out? If you want to do it that much, then just the guys do it. Well, what are you gonna do? Uh, all right. I'll show you what it means to be a man. All right, Kanji, let's do this. Hey, wait, you idiot! Well, you told us to. Yeah! And I'm the only one who looks cool. They just dodged out of the way. Kanji's dead. How? I didn't know it was possible to stand on your own face. That's an advanced yoga position there, Kanji. And Narakami is the only one who looks slightly cool. Busted the fuck out of his knee, but he looks cool doing it. Yay. Or so we tell ourselves. I think it's a success. We played a kick-ass show. Welcome back. Anyway, Dojima, I had a pretty productive day at Juness. Played a kick-ass show, sold out all the seats. Yeah, nobody wanted to pop in, uh... To hang out with Narakami this night either, so just hanging out at the shrine again, I guess. Yeah, the guide really wanted me to just focus on Eri, even though, like, drawing the uh, fortunes that I did, I should be able to get closer with her on the next social link anyway. What he really should have said was I, and maybe it did, and I just misread it. I social link. Whenever, uh, I had to go out of order of the guide from CAD FC because I had to just focus a few days, as you'll soon see on the next update, on just going to the shrine and, like, drawing fortunes for I. Because I otherwise I would have missed the, uh, social link day. Oh, well, it was resolved. It's fine. I just miss a bike ride with, uh, Yukiko. And that's not really much of a me of a loss. Either one of these options sound kind of dickish. Help each other. What do I need help with? I'm Narakami, I get perfects on all my tests. Yeah, they want to do a study group, but we're not going to do that. We got social links to handle. We just had a big band practice. I gotta hang out with other people and help them with their social links and make them better people in general. So apparently Napoleon didn't, Napoleon invented glass jars. He made people invent glass jars, I should say.
that's... Huh. Yeah, I guess you would have to, like, improvise a can opener. Not sure why you wouldn't invent a can opener alongside the can. I built a way that we can pr that we can uh, carry our food in cans. Good. How do we get it out? Oh, you you wanted it out? Oh shit. Oh. Hi, I guess the study session is in hey. this cutscene, so never you. mind. Greetings but they're gonna ask you. again in the next update. Looks like you're having fun. Yo. Wow, everyone's here. So many people. Time to study. Why did everyone come here? Exam study group. Times like these, I'm jealous of Teddy. It seems like a dream that we had a live concert here only yesterday. You guys fell on your faces. So much I looked cool, though. I didn't think the crowd would get that excited. But enough of that. Let's start with proving the trigonometric identities. Ah. Uh... Oh, so jumping straight into math? That sucks. Start with something easy like English. Trig functions, right? The one where we find the area of a triangle given two sides and... Huh? You find the area of a triangle with... You know, that thing. Um... Base by height by two. If you don't math mind, is stupid. Who needs it? You? Oh, are you as smart as I thought? Could you, uh, lend me a hand too? Oh, um, I wouldn't know where to begin with second year's subjects. But you solve murders. Uh, what's up with that? Useless after all. Dick. Don't call me useless. You're not useless. You're awesome, Naoto. <laughs> I think I figured out what buttons to push to get Naoto Kun riled up. You're pretty cute when you're angry. Oh, Yosuke, the lovable what? dick. What are you talking about? <laughs> That's it. I quit. This just ain't my thing. To hell with the exams. It's time for my animal crackers. <laughs> Ooh, can I have some Smart plan, Kanji. Penguin. Hands off the penguin. It's mine. I lost my animal crackers once. I'm not losing them twice. And Yosuke steals them again. Is that a bag of Doritos on the friggin' table? That's so weird. Amnesia is hilarious. It's really fun. But the more I feel that way, the more I want to know who I really am. I've surfed the net, read manga, watched TV. I even went to a place called the library, but I still can't find anything about me. I feel Narakami should just Even smack Teddy on the back of the head every time he makes a bear pun. Still, I'm starting to get an idea. Or just have a jar. That's another dollar in a jar for every bear pun, Teddy. Isn't this your first time sharing a theory about yourself? I lived in that other world. That world was my reality. Naoto's, now, Nanako's right there. Are you the really sure you, we want to be bringing this up in front of her? And over in that place filled with shadows, I think oh, we're just going to talk about shadows and the TV being. world in front of Nanako? Cool. Cool. I don't remember anything from back then, though. Maybe it's that amnesia thing I read about in a book the other day. It's true. There are some aspects of the other world that make it seem as though it's rooted in human thoughts. Still, there's no point in applying the principles of logic and deduction to a place like that. But the fact that you existed in such a world from the beginning adds credibility to your theory. There is little doubt that you are a special being on the other side. If you yourself know nothing about it, perhaps it's true that part of your memory is missing. Tell me, what is the earliest memory you can call to mind? It's from a while ago. I've always lived there, as far as I could tell. Then it started to get noisy, so when I happened to bump into Sensei and Yosuke, I asked them to do something about it. I see. If you've always been on that side, you'd have no sense of time or days. That would be pretty bad. Oh, that's right! Nanako-chan's completely clueless about all this. I'm gonna tell I'm my dad sorry, about this. We didn't mean to leave you out. Hey! I think Teddy must be a king. Oh they dear. A story that a king was all alone inside a forest because of a bad guy's curse. Isn't that what happened to you, Teddy? Don't give him an ego boost, Nanako. King. Well, when you put it that way, it sounds about right. Oh man. Teddy? A king? <laughs> I can see him wearing a cape. That's his outfit and dancing all night. He wears a little crown and a cape. You go into laughing fits in front of anyone now. 
Can we not talk about Teddy being a king? Here? I still had the taste of huh? bear on my lips. Look at that face. Teddy really was a king. There were all these other kings too, and we all. And I hey, smooched a guy. About what happened at the club? Quiet, you not in front of Nanako Chan. It got really racy in there. Am I really a king? <laughs> if I'm a king, I'll get to smooch girls every day. No, that's not what that means. That's not what that means, Teddy. No, bad Teddy, bad. I have this fuzzy Hit him with a newspaper. I'll find out sooner or later with your help, Sensei. But yay, gotta give Teddy a bit of an ego boost. You can't be a dick to Teddy, not always. He doesn't know any better. You kind of need to teach him to know better, but still, he... More or less, he's just a kid. Sort of. But now he can endure a mortal hey, blow. Teddy! Is melon soda okay? Melon energy. Now I want to watch Kamen Rider Gaim. Yeah, I don't think the King's Game is a proper topic for Nanako. That just doesn't seem right. So we're gonna draw a fortune for Yukiko. Because, as I said, we're gonna work on Yukiko's social link today. And this will actually get her up to rank 9, and this, for the Priestess Arcana, is where things start to become more intimate. Where you have an option to choose whether or not you want to pursue the Lover's Path with Yukiko or not. Yeah! I show off both options. Again, I think the only time I don't show off both options for a female social link is Rise. And that's because in both the Harem run and in my Standard run, I go for Lovers on both paths. So, I don't know. You can look that up yourselves of somebody who does not want to give Risei a hug after she's crying. So that's an interesting theory. So all the shadows are based on stuff we've seen on TV. I guess that makes sense because there's Hulk Hogan wrestler shadows. There's cop shadows. There's lion shadows. There's stuff that are, while they are shadow, they are shadows, they do seem familiar if you've watched a lot of TV. I guess there's some weight to that argument. Turnips. Turnips were the first jack-o'-lanterns. That would have made the Headless Horseman a lot less scary. It also would have made Jack-O from Guilty Gear seem a little more goofy. So, it's raining, and we're not going to be able to do that social link in the rain just yet. We will handle that, but in the next update. We always see that attendant, they're just hanging out in the rain, like a weirdo. Um... Okay, bye Namatame, nice talking to you. I don't think he's handling Mayumi Yamano's death very well. But anyway, let's buy some equipment for Naoto. Because I do plan on using her in the next dungeon. Because Naoto's awesome.
So apparently the love letters that Hisano lost were found by Daidara. Go figure. Apparently they were at your local smithy. I'm not sure if Hisano would have ever found these because I don't know if she, like, comes to see Daidara's metal works. I don't know. Time to go to Okina. Time to go watch another movie. Or the same movie, but with a different person. It's still playing Dachiko, and it's gonna be for the rest of October. So Narukami's seen this sad dog movie three times now! But let's hang out with Rise. Bringing Rise to a movie is a little weird, considering she doesn't actively participate in combat. And really, the only benefit she might get from a movie is just a quick level up. Sorry to make you I mean, that's useful and all, but eh. It feels like the stats could be used for uh, <laughs> other party members. But hey, we finally get to see a movie with our girlfriend. Hello, Hooray. So I wonder what Risei's reaction to the movie was. Yukiko laughed, Kanji got notice noticeably upset, so what's Risei's? That was fun. She had a good time. We should do that again. I guess Risei just has a very standard uh, reaction if it's not the movie she wanted to go see. Eh. I guess because her stats didn't increase, she doesn't have any like particular thing to say about it. Oh, welcome home, big bro. Yeah, this huge fish thing would have been useful for the Hermit Arcana. A lot of these fish things that are coming in fucking October would have been pretty damn useful on the Hermit Social Link. Ugh. That seems like a dick move I just did. Cause I see uh, Chi, I was like, hey, I'm gonna hang Oh no, wait, I maxed out her social link. No point. No point in hanging out with anybody whose social link I've maxed. You know, like a friend would. But yay, Kanji. Cause Kanji's awesome. All my party members are awesome. Most of the characters in this game are awesome. Except for Mitsuo. He's an asshole. Fuck Mitsuo. Midterms start tomorrow. Ugh. So in the next update, we're gonna do those midterms. As usual, we're gonna ace them. So, nothing much more to say on that. Culture Festival, that's the more important thing to focus on. We're gonna learn about the Culture Festival in the next update, but as to actually doing that, that'll be on the update after. Look forward to that. Oh my goodness. As usual, Kashiwagi is just weird. She just keeps making, like, sexual comments in front of a bunch of, like, high schoolers. I know this word from my animes. Obasan. Ojisan. I know that because Jotaro calls his grant calls Joseph Gigi all the time. And then Obasan or Obachan means grandma.
Anyway, let's go hang out with Yukiko. It's time to rank nine. Fortunately, now that we've gotten past the awkward part of this social link, everything's good from now on. We dealt with the scumbag TV show, guys. So now we just get to hang out with Yukiko. So that's cool. I really wish the fox would pop up during some of these social links. Whenever they're in front of the shrine. Are you gonna wish for something too? So the correct answer is for you. Even though that seems really like you're just hitting on her. I'm wishing for everyone's health. For Chie, for you, for the others, and everyone at the inn too. And I'm wishing to become a woman worthy of you. Finally, I wish for everyone to be able to smile together. Let's begin our prayer. So I got some bad news for you, Yukiko. I've decided not to leave Inaba. Yay! I never really objected to being the inn's manager per se. You don't have to be tied I down to it if you don't want to. It wasn't up to me. I felt that my life was on rails. And I thought running away was the only choice for me. But no longer. I want to protect the family inn. After all, it's near to my heart. Aw, that's sweet. Um, thank you. I think it's because of you that I realized this. Because you were always by my side. Now, despite the fact that Narakami made an obvious, like, hitting on Yukiko line, we're not gonna pursue that. We're just gonna go with just the friends option for this por portion of the update. Um, I wanted to ask you this before. Um, why? Why are you always with me? So here's the critical moment. She's blushing. She's got the blushy blushes. But what do we do? Is it okay for me to ask? So, you're my friend. I see. Yeah. <sighs> yes, precisely. Oh, I just remembered. I have an errand to run. I'll be going now. Yeah, she was, uh... I don't know if she took the rejection that well. I mean, she put up a decent front, but I don't think Yukiko was really expecting that answer. However, fortunately, in an alternate timeline, in the harem path, all right, now let's see what happens if we actually say that we really like her. Again, a lot of the correct answers kind of makes it seem like Narakami's hitting on everybody. And I guess that makes sense, you know, given like his title in Persona 4 Arena. But still, again, it kind of seems like he's leading people on. And then he says, nah, I just want to be friends. I just happen to too? flirt a lot. He's like the he's like uh, the main character from Undertale. Me? He flirts, but he doesn't go any further. He just wants to be friends. Go figure. Wishing for everyone's but in this help. instance, Narakami Chie, is actually gonna try uh, becoming a little bit more and intimate Chie. with Yukiko. And I'm wishing to become a woman worthy of you. Ooh. Finally, I wish for everyone to be able to smile. You only get one wish. You can't just like put two, multiple wishes on one day. That's not how the wishing box works. The wish box takes one wish per day. Not to leave At least I think it only takes one wish per day. If it didn't, then phew, the hermit social link would have been really crazy. The inn's manager per se. I just didn't like the fact that it wasn't up to me. I felt that my life was on rails, and I thought running away was the only choice for me. But no longer. I want to protect the family inn. After all, it's near to my heart. Um, thank you. I think it's because of you that I realized this. 
because you were always by my side. We'll be getting up to rank 10 soon enough. And then maybe Yukiko's persona will evolve, just like Chie's. Um, I wanted to ask you this before. So instead of saying, um, because why? Yukiko is your friend, why are you on this particular uh, encounter, we decide to acknowledge her feelings. for me to ask? So what you need to say is, I really like you. You... you like... Yeah. Me? Uh... um... <laughs> I feel the same She's way, got the really big so... blushy blushes now. Well, that's another inti intimate relationship on uh, the harem path. And it's probably gonna keep going on the next um, update too. Stay here with me, just a little longer. All right. Well, on the next update, we're actually gonna finish up the Moon Arcana, and we'll also do a few more social links, and maybe get a little bit more plot. So, until then, thank you so much for watching. Welcome back. Some dream keeps me going through the night